guys, you have the ball and you call timeout with 38 seconds left. What was that huddle like? What shot were you guys looking for there? Uh, we were just trying to get our team's best shot, put us, uh, the right players in the right situation just to make the play. Um, we, got, we got a good open shot for Caleb. He was wide open for the three. Just ain't fall. How, CJ, how does this loss sit for you? It hurts. Um, it hurts a lot, especially when you're in a game like that. Made the right plays the whole game, and then, I mean, that happens. And just trying to get back on the road, you know, get back in the win column, and then that happens. So it just hurts. It hurts a lot. Kyle, so, did this one feel like you guys had had it going, that it was going finally going the right direction? I mean, does it uh, feel like something di different than the last five or six games? Yeah, no. Um, you know, we felt like we were competing. Uh, we were playing hard. Um, our energy was good. Our energy was better than it's been. Um, you know, that's why it's disappointing. It's a, it's a tough loss because, you know, we felt like we were in it. You know, we felt like we were going to win that game. So. Is this disappointment, is it staying more than some of the others you felt in the last couple of weeks, or are they all the same? I mean, we just got to take it on the chin and get to the next game. You know, the game's over. There's nothing we can do about it now. Um, play Northwestern on Sunday, so we got to get back to uh, prepping for them. So, CJ, to go back to Adam's question, when you guys came out of the timeout, you were not looking for anything specific. There was no get it to this guy, get it to this guy. We're trying to get this. It was just, were you just running motion or what? What were you I mean, trying to get? We were trying to get into a play to get. We were trying to get a back door out the corner for Dwayne, you know, get an easy layup. Uh, they took the way to the back door. Um, then Dwayne got the ball. He drove baseline. Everybody collapsed and K was wide open. So, I mean, it happens in basketball. Every play is not going to be ran perfect. So, you just had to make adjustments. So, the plan was not to get Caleb the ball in the post? Not in a point in time. We were trying to get a back door. CJ, can you just take me through the, the Marcus Carr shot at the end? Um, what, do you, what do you remember from, from that specific play? And oh, it was a guard to guard switch. Um, he has it. I contested. He made the shot. Wouldn't, I mean, I think it's been about a month right now, and it just feels like you guys just really can't really get out of this. I just wonder, like, is, does, it, does it feel all sudden right now that, that it, I mean, even a month ago or so, it just felt like you guys were, had, had something rolling? Oh, we most definitely did. Um, we just got to figure it out. I mean, that's the only thing that I can pretty much say. Um, I mean, we did have a roll in those first 10, 11 games, um, and we just some, somewhat hit a slump, so we just got to get out of it. Coach Holtman has been talking about he didn't know if the toughness, team toughness, is where it needs to be. Did you guys take that? Have you taken that to heart? Do you think it was better tonight? Do you feel like you played uh, tough enough? Yeah, I mean, you got to take things like that personal, especially somebody like, I want to say try your manhood, but, you know, just on that, you know, trying to emphasize that. So we took that on the chin as a team, you know, to try to do that this game, which I felt like we did for 39 minutes of the game and just came down to that shot. So. Kyle, late, you had, I think, six straight points. And it seemed like you were able to make some more effort plays tonight than, than you've been able to. Your, your body has let you the last couple of games. Uh, what were you feeling those last couple of minutes as some of those were going in and you guys took the lead there late? Um, you know, I was just getting lost in the game. Uh, my motor definitely felt a little bit better tonight. Um, I think it's improving. But um, yeah, it's just, I mean, getting lost in the game with your teammates and making the right plays. Uh, you guys had 15 free throws in the first half. I think you only had three in the second half. Did they do something different that kept you guys from getting to the line, or did you guys um, not attack as aggressively as you did in the first? Um, I wouldn't say they did anything differently. We just didn't get to the line as much, didn't get the same calls. You know, we just didn't put enough pressure on the rim how we did in the first half. Kyle, you uh, tied the game and gave you guys a lead, just sort of doing what you do, playing off your teammates and getting in the right spots, but then when you had that timeout, I guess coach is going offense, defense there, and he, and he doesn't put you in. Uh, like, Do you want to be in there? Do you think you should be in there when you're the guy who, who was making those tough buckets you guys needed to make late? I mean, you always want to be uh, in the game, but you know you got to trust the coach to make the right decisions. And um, at the time, you know they, they was playing heavy off of me, so um, we might have not been able to get what we needed um, if it was going to be to go inside or you know, get a skip pass or something like that. So, um, you know, we thought our best opportunity was, you know, for me to come out at the time and then um, sub a guard in. So 